hello and welcome to my 22 beanie vlog Good morning everybody. I need to take out my headphones. I've still got them in. I just went on a little birthday round. I did a 5k. Nothing mental. Just because everyone was saying happy birthday to me and it made me feel so like loved and happy. So I just got loads of energy and I was like I'm gonna go on a birthday round. It is my birthday today. Look at this. I woke up and my mum had put these such cute balloons everywhere. Today I'm gonna do a what I eat in a day birthday treat day edition. Because we don't believe in cheat days here. Nothing is cheating. We're only treating ourselves. You need to see the cake. You just need to see the cake. This was the running outfit of the day. Got my little Gymshark bra on. My Lulu's. And then I got this little fanny pack. <laughs> my mum's organised this huge birthday brunch but I don't know what's in it. So I'm going to go down and eat that. Now. I've already actually had like a breakfast because I need to eat before I do any exercise. Wow. Oh my goodness. What do we have? Walk me through the brunch. We got some yoghurt here. Our fresh baguette. That's what I've been craving. Chunky salad. Some meats. And oh my favourite ever, borsin. Some dressings. Some Root. Plate one. I've got sort of a weird concoction. I've got, and I put in the borsin cheese with some turkey and some red onion. And I've just got some chicken skewers. And, and this one I'm going to put cheese. And then I'm going to have a yogurt bowl. I've got so much to have. Plate number two. I've gone for the sweet now. Yogurt, fruit, and yeah. I've had quite a lot of bread. I'm getting a bit bread full. I am... Um, Stuffed. We're gonna have some tea because I'm a granny. My mum actually bought the prosecco. She was like, "Let's pop the prosecco." And I was just like, "Mum, it's what even is the time?" Well, it's actually like midday, but I need some herbal tea. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna be some cute balloons. I've got so many balloons. I got all these. You'll see. Have you seen the other room? No, I haven't. There is a lot no, of balloons. No. So out for birthday activity. It's not the birthday. Actually. No, it's not. I'm Friday, doing a whole vlog so. on so. what he's organised for my birthday day. You're only doing two hours because he's going to watch the football. No, I'm not. It was... Yeah, you are. Yeah, but not. Uh, it's not till eight. Well, it's yeah. It's twelve now. Anyways, anyways, <laughs> we're going to Top Golf for the birthday activity. Yeah, but it's not the block. Actual birthday activity. No, the birthday day yeah, activity. But... This is the birthday activity <laughs> of the day. We're going to Top Golf. Yeah, but it's not the Frank, only activity. Thanks. They get it for today. I'm glad they get it. <laughs> it's a little... uh, oh. Although this is my what I in day, this is Frankie's lunch. Some chips, chicken wings. And some carrots. Carrots. You love chips. I think chips yeah, is your right. your favourite food. No, favorite. It is. When we went on holiday, you had chips every day. Not you did. I remember because I I, I was a bit shocked. <laughs> when you get the spaghetti sauce, you know when you have bolognese and you get the sauce around your mouth and it gives you the ick. <laughs> Wow, look at this cake my mum made. She sort of did the same as me, the happy 22 B day Eva with these lovely little flowers on. It's absolutely amazing. Oh my goodness. My afternoon snack, I'm gonna have, obviously, a slice of the cake. <gasps> wow. Oh my God. Can you see how good that looks? This is the best birthday cake I have ever had. I will link the recipe below. It's from this woman called Martha. She won the Great British Bake Off. It's called like a devil's chocolate cake, but the best bit about it is this bit, the icing, because it's like a ganache, but it's not icing, because I find icing really sticky. It's like, it's literally so soft, and it's just sensational. I will see you when I eat something else. Me and my mum up this. I'm gonna go into the shops. Just have a little browse around. Hello everybody. I may have made a little bit of a mistake. It is now Friday. After I went out with my mum, I just sort of zoned out. Lived in the moment. I, I didn't really think about the vlogging, so I forgot to film what I ate for the rest of that day. 
But today I'm going into London with Frankie for his sort of surprise element of my birthday. And I just thought, I'll take you with me to that instead. I have got on a really nice old poly dress. Let me show you all the outfit. It's just this pink one. And I'm gonna wear my sunglasses. And yeah, so I'm really excited. I just feel like I'm constantly in London. Also, I thought I'd show you this really beautiful bag. It's from a company called Teddy Blake, which is a premium bag company. A New York company, but the leather is like proper Italian leather and they're Italian craftsmen. They're just absolutely amazing. And I just love the smell of it. You know when you walk into a shoe shop and you just get that woof of real leather not the fake leather this is what you get from this it's just so nice so thank you so much to teddy blake they gave it to me as like a birthday present one thing i hate when i go into london is i always take just a tiny little bag and then i end up having to carry so much and it's just such a hassle so if i take this one with me it's a little bit more of a sensible size because it's not big you know, it's not like a chunky bag that could fit in a laptop, but then it's a little bit bigger than your normal bag, so you can actually put everything in it. Right, we're in Bar Elba. This drink is absolutely delicious. Stunning. It's stunning. How's yours? I'm not trying. Have you not tried it yet, silly? Is that nice? It was my nicer. Uh, they're quite similar. These are good. They actually are similar. Really? I look so rough and I actually feel just as rough as I look. The day, I, I have gone out every single day this week. I have drunk for about four days in a row. My body just needs a rest. We gotta have some more birthday cake. It's my last slice. This cake served 16. Me and my mum have both eaten it together within three days. Hopefully it all goes to the bun. Mm -mm -mm. This is your sign. If you feel like you want a bit of chocolate cake, chocolate, this is your sign to go and get a slice of cake for me for my birthday so you can celebrate with me hello again everybody i feel like this is a daily occurrence at the moment me just finishing on a random note and then coming back the next morning all dressed up but this is the last day night of the birthday vlog tonight i'm gonna go into clapham with my girls just the two of them just thought it was quite nice a smaller group because it was such a last minute like organized thing i did I, like we wouldn't have been able to find a bar for like everybody. Oh, you've broken like this. This is, I think it's called Gorilla Pod. The leg keeps coming off, so I'm just gonna hold you. But tonight I'm going to Clapham and I'm very excited. I'm not gonna take you with me. I've learned every single time I take you with me on a night out, I either almost break you, lose you, sit on you. I just would rather not have the responsibility of having a camera there. I just feel like I need to start doing outfit of the days in other places than my main mirror. I need to update you all about my night yesterday with Frankie. We went to this place called Crazy Pizza Marley Bone or Knightsbridge. It's just, there's two locations and it's meant to be really cool. Meant to see the pizzerias spinning the pizzas all frantically and the design was so pretty but they didn't spin the pizzas and the pizzas were genuinely so thin. They were like Rivita crisp breads. I like a thick, I like a Neapolitan dough. Although that pizza, it was expensive. If you're gonna go there for pizza, I just think go, you go for the experience of them spinning. But we didn't even get the experience. I was a bit let down by that place, to be honest. Such a greedy pig. I need to stop. I I need to stop. I then was like, Frankie, Frankie, I'm so hungry. We went to this place in, it's called Carnaby Circus. The nearest tube station, I think, is Oxford Circus. And it's amazing in there. If you've got like a first day or like you want to go out with your friends for a night, go to Carnaby because it's this huge building. It's where the acai e bowl place was. Basically, there's just a loads of different like food stalls in there. Not even stalls, like food restaurants and like bars. And it was so fun because there's three floors. We had booked this place called the Rum Kitchen, but there was such a big queue to get in, even if you had booked. So we were like, oh, we'll just sit down. We went and sat down in the downstairs bit, and there was this place called Pizza Pilgrims. And I decided to get a pizza. I had just come from having a pizza and I went and got another pizza. It's so awful, but this pizza was like thick. 
and oh it's even worse they gave us the rewarder so these poor people i've been waiting for ages they gave me and frankie their pizzas i did think it was our order so i just started eating it all but yeah i had the most amazing time just love love going out i absolutely love going out with frankie let's go to let's go to the bathroom and do the outfit of the day today Black crop, black jeans, and I'm gonna wear the nicest sparkly shoes. They are honestly sensational. I got them in the sale, the Dune sale, but this top, oh, it's very tight. If you wanna get this, size up, because it's literally so tight around here, it's pushing all of my fat, or like all my organs, down, and it's sort of making you feel like I can't breathe, but beauty's pain we're gonna have to work with it i think i'm gonna conclude my vlog here i'll do a little montage tonight but i've had the most loveliest birthday week ever and it's gonna come home tomorrow i feel it it's birthday luck you know i'll manifest it for everybody i'm sorry everybody my manifesting didn't work. Thanks so much for watching my birthday vlog. Sorry it's been so all over the place. Like, honestly, I guess when you're having a good time and you're living in the moment, it is going to be all over the place because I'm not just going to plan out my birthday around videoing my food. So, yes. oh, I just, oh my God, that's the difference that lighting makes. Ready? No lighting. Lighting. This light is actually so good. You just tap. See you then, honeys.